there has been relatively little advancement in the field of the dedicated attack helicopter platform with primary, globally operated, types in the Boeing AH-64 Apache and Milmi-24 Hind both being born in the Cold War period, 1947 to 1991. Even the Russian Army, operating two attack helotypes in the Milmi-28 Havoc and Kamovka 50 Black Shark series, use platforms rooted in the Cold War years when tanks were to rule the battlefields of Europe. The Italian Army operates the Agus 2A129 Mangusta but even this product emerged during the 1980s. More recent efforts has resulted in the Eurocopter Tiger, introduced in 2003 but fewer than 150 being built, and the T-129 attack from Turkey, though this is based in the Italian A-129 platform. The U.S. Marines has introduced a heavily upgraded form of the classic Bell H-1 Huey Cobra line in the Viper series. As such, it is of great interest that Leonardo of Italy has announced an all-new development venture with its AW249. The aircraft is set to follow tried and proven design practices for helicopters by included a twin, side-by-side -side engine arrangement for maximum power and survivability, a stepped cockpit configuration for pilot and gunner, and rugged, fixed tail dragging undercarriage. Concept artwork reveals a platform set to carry a chin-mounted, trainable automatic cannon and port and starboard side wing stubs for ordnance, three hard points to a wing. Over the fuselage is a low-mounted, five-bladed main rotor while the tail is set to feature a starboard side facing four-bladed tail rotor unit to counter torque. The fuselage is depicted with smooth, angled panels. Leonardo Spa was granted a 487 million euro deal in January of 2017 for the development of four aircraft encompassing a single flyable prototype and three pre-production forms. Requirements by any army service for their attack helicopter platforms has not changed, survivability is key for both crew and aircraft alike so stealth measures will be implemented into the new August product by way of reduced radar cross-section and low signature engines. To help drive development, the Italian army has insisted on utilization of some in-service components such as a 20mm TM-197B autocannon by Otto Meller for the chin weapon, the Israeli spike anti-tank guided missile, ATGM, family for the anti-tank measure, and the main rotor and gearbox of the Agus 2 AW-149 medium lift helicopter series. Beyond this. The turboshaft installations for power would be either the proven American-originated General Electric CT-72E1 or the French Saffron Anetto currently employed in the Leonardo AW189K model, both set to offer output power in the 2000 horsepower range.